Good evening guys, Vez3D here. Again, again having fun with that little new monster there. Main Cell team has talked to me and they wanted to see their logo printed at ludicrous speed. <laughs> Fastest as I could do with this machine. So challenge accepted and I've done this slicing on their cool logo there. And it's gonna try to print at a thousand millimeters per second with 50k acceleration and it's currently set to 50k axel and deceleration corner speed is 10 and i have no idea hope oh, there's a bit of plastic i might need to remove there you go i have no idea how this is going to work because this is the first time i print with ludicrous spe speed sorry on this printer and uh yeah we will find out so it's warming up right now and uh, for this test I'm using PLA, uh, it's PLAF actually. You don't find these uh, material anymore, at least I couldn't find anything. It's a buddy of mine I sent me this pool say hey this is PLA added with ABS and it flows like crazy so you might want to give it a shot. So here I am trying to print with that one and I'll see if that is capable of height speed. I'm pretty sure it's going to be good because I've tested it with other print, not, not as quick as this one. This is going to be the first torture test that I do on this VZBot, that VZ235. Um, hopefully everything will work. <laughs> we never know at that speed. Um, yeah, and that, that will also tell us if we have something loose on, on the printer. Um, it's complaining about, let's just restart that. Oh, hold on, I have my Z offset, not set, should be zero. Okay, there we go. Actually, I might lower it down a bit. I have installed my buzzle nozzle, so I might be a little off in terms of Z, but that looks decent. Yep, that looks very good. So that's what 50K looks like at normal speed. That's 100 or 150. And that color, sorry, uh, main cell guys, because it is not as red as your logo. Um, quickly, I might want to remove this. Okay, I'm not gonna put my hands there anymore because <laughs> that thing is about to speed up. That's going to be very interesting to see how it's going to print and if it's going to be able to handle that super, super massive high speed printing. There we go. Okay. Wow. It looks super stable. It looks very, very stable. <laughs> Hey, there you go. So there you go, main cell team. Here is your logo printed at high speed. And that is high, high, high speed. bit more heat. That's gonna help. Not that it's not flowing enough, but surface quality will improve with a bit more speed, a bit more temperature, I mean. <laughs> yeah, and I, I think that printer can, can even take more than that. I'm not too sure if that's necessary, but... <laughs> okay, now surface quality is improving a bit with heat. Ha 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 ha! 
<laughs> okay, I find it funny. I know it's stupid, but damn, I love I love this thing. <laughs> I'm at 60 frames per second right now on the camera, and I'm pretty sure it's not even able to follow that thing. That is so cool to watch. <laughs> it makes me laugh every time. Let's go! <laughs> and yeah, nothing is shaking. You see that? It's, it's very good. Thousand millimeters per second, 50k. Should we give it more? Do you guys want to see more? Let's do that. Let's go. 1100 millimeters per second. Can you do this little VZ? Hell yeah, you can do it. 1100. <laughs> Can you do 1200? 1200 at 50k? Um, let's let's go. 1200. <laughs> Woo! 1250k. <laughs> That's probably the fastest mainsail logo I've ever seen. And it's probably capable of more, but I'm pretty sure now we are close to maxing out that poor little nozzle to 0 0.5. And we should be close to. Um, 60 cubic millimeters per second right now it's a very good torture test and I'm very happy on how this little printer is handling it so just I just want to give it 10 more 130 1300 millimeters per second this thing is mad. <laughs> Woo. Damn. Let's zoom in a bit. There's absolutely no cooling. Maybe I should have enabled cooling. <laughs> that part is the most exciting one. All right, let's let's just stop that one. Um, no, let's not stop here. Let's crank it up more. 1500. Yo, <laughs> it's doing it. I like that little dance.
All right, all right, all right. We can't stop there. We have to reach 1500. It's only gonna affect the long run anyway, because th that is too too short of a of a move to reach speed. But that that might be reaching it. I have to do the math to know when it's gonna reach it. But that reaches it for sure. <laughs> oh, and we're gonna stop there. So, <laughs> hey, sorry, little VZ. Um, that was your limit right there, huh? and it might not be um. The limit, it might be processing limits. I've seen this kind of weird noise when we reach a step rate that is just too high that the the processor can handle or, or the electronics, but I have a new board coming soon with much more performance. So, a new board, new drivers, <laughs> we're gonna be able to push a bit more, I think. But that was a cool experiment, so now I know this guy is rock solid and it is capable of super high speed. So that was it. Um, I'm gonna just stop there and I thank you for watching this one. I know it was stupid, but I like doing stupid things. <laughs> so you don't have to do it, but I, I, I do it for you. So I do these, these stupid things so I can see where the printer is breaking, if it is breaking and it's not, it's capable of doing that crazy stupid thing <laughs> so have a good night everyone and uh main cell here's your logo printed at ludicrous speed on this have a good night goodbye